So I get this question all the time. Why does a fire truck show up when I need a life squad? So there's actually two explanations for this. One is that the fire truck has gone as what we call first responders to assess the patient until the squad gets available. Say they were out at the hospital, they were doing something else. So you're going to get a fire truck. Um, their crew is going to assess the patient and let the squad crew know what's going on and what items they need or may need when they get there. So the other thing is what we call protocol runs. There's your chest pains, your shortness of breath, your stroke-like symptoms, your cardiac arrest. So the fire truck rolls with the life squad so that we have hands to do everything. How many of you have seen the television uh, show where you know they're bringing in, they're bringing a cardiac monitor, they're bringing in drug bags, they're bringing in what we call first to respond, uh, first in bag, um, oxygen, they're carrying a cot. So this all takes hands and with just two people on a squad, it is really hard to bring all that stuff in and give a good level of care. So the engine company comes in, they help us carry in our equipment, We've got guys there who can do CPR. Um, we can get procedures done uh, at the same time because you're getting, you know, you've got one guy to do an IV, you've got one guy to do innovations, and you've got other guys to draw up drugs if we need drugs. So, in a nutshell, that is why you would see a squad and a fire truck together on certain runs. So, my name's Jim Fletcher and thank you for watching my video.